and welcome back to another video with Glamorous Gems. My name is Ebony and in today's video we are going to be jumping into a nail haul, a gel polish nail haul. So Nail Addict is a company that reached out to me and they are a new business and they sell gel polishes and what I really love about their gel polishes is that they are vegan and cruelty free so I definitely love that about it so it's a healthier alternative on your nails and I will have a discount code for you gems I believe it's glamorous so if you are new here welcome 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 make sure you hit that subscribe button that way you never miss a new upload from me and of course if you are a returning gem welcome back sis so yeah we're gonna go ahead and jump into nail attic but I want to tell y'all a little bit about my nails and how I generally like to do them so pre-covid I normally got my nails done in acrylic with gel polish and I love that because I normally just go once per month in doing that however once covid happened I was like I'm not going I'm not trying to get caught up or catch nothing I was just real extra real extra cautious so anyway I just kind of been painting my nails at home and I've been using normal polish but I do prefer gel however I don't really have a good professional drill or a um, gel UV light and I could probably buy one on Amazon and if y'all are interested I'll leave links down below for that but anyhow um, I'm really appreciative that they reached out to me and they sent me some gel polishes because it's good to have some in the collection and um, anyway so on my birthday I went ahead and went to the nail shop and I'll show y'all in the clip so I went to the nail shop um, and they went ahead and gave me some SNS nails and although they came out really pretty I'm just not a fan of SNS I don't know what it is it just feels weird dipping my nails in the powder but also what I didn't like about it was so over time if I knock my nail up against something like I just feel like the pain of that I don't really know what was going on with it so for me I'm just kind of a gel polish girl or an acrylic with gel polish it just does me so right I do have some stuff at, at home that I have for nail care um, because of COVID I wanted to be more self-conscious and making sure I had enough tools and supplies that I needed um, to do my nails and then also I did go to cosmetology school so I have a I know a lot about nails I actually know how to do them I'm just lazy but anyway um, long story short I think it's important to have a small collection of nail stuff so that way you can do your nails at home but I want y'all to tell me y'all's craziest nail salon story because one of my favorite youtubers um, she recently went to the nail shop and they cut her foot like on top of her foot and it got an infection and then they was fussing like they didn't want to give her money back and that her kids was the problem and I'm like hold on wait a minute if you cut my foot you the problem and you better be lucky that I don't seek legal action against you so it just kind of makes you want to like do your nails on your own um, but then also when y'all go to the nail shop I would highly recommend to get your own nail file get your own buffer you know get your own stuff and keep it in like a ziploc bag and you can just take it with you every time you go because a lot of these nail shops they use the same nail file and drill on you and if they cut somebody and then they bleed on that and then they cut you I mean it's just doing a whole lot and I'm slightly a hypochondriac so I always think about like the worst possible scenario but that helps me out because if it doesn't turn out to be that at least I kind of looked out so anyway um, I don't know if it's like a cancer thing or what but I've always been that way so yeah I'm done rambling but y'all leave comments down below and let me know y'all's craziest nail story because I just think it's crazy like you cut my foot and then you blame my child for running around the shop that you couldn't focus but my child is here because you offer services for children so don't blame my child you need to look at yourself and realize you cut my foot and you need to be glad that I'm not taking legal act like I just think that's crazy so yeah y'all let me know your craziest nail shop story I don't know but in the meantime let's jump into nail attic so anyway I mean it came in a box like this and then they just have it in like these little crinkle cut papers there so I have five polishes plus a base coat so um this is the packaging so actually i'm gonna take them all out just so you gems can see a little bit better so this is the matte top coat i'm not sure if you can see so it's just a clear top coat and then i have this electric rose so it's like a pretty pink color then i have the just a flirt so i like the names that they have too they're really cute 
And then I have this blue. My husband, it's called Fun in a Bottle. Mm hmm My husband's always telling me, like, every time I ask him, what color should I get? He's like, get blue. I really like blue nails. But every time I go, I never do it because I'm the kind of girl where it's like, if it's, if I can't figure out what color that I want, I'm going I'm to pick pink or white. But anyway, um, so I got blue just to see how he would like that. And then I have C Swing and Sun. I think it's good to have a nude color because this is like what you can use year round. And then finally, this is the color that they sent me um, that I guess it was replacement for another color, but I'm not sure what that other color was now that I think about it. But this one is called Best of Summer. However, it's definitely giving fall vibes. So I'm not sure how it's called Best of Summer. But anyway, we're gonna try this out. It's really pretty. So that's what it looks like out of the um, bottle. So yeah, we're gonna try her out. Hopefully y'all can see me. in a bottle so we're gonna go ahead and paint and I love how beautiful this blue is it's gorgeous They look like with just one nail coat so yeah so it's a beautiful yellow so it looks just like that out of the bottom so yeah let's try it on and see how she does gems enjoyed the video definitely check out nail addict i will have their link in the description box below and i believe my discount code is going to be glamorous so i'll have all of that information in the description box below leave comments down below letting me know which color was your fave which one was not so fave because y'all know which one i wasn't too keen on but yeah i really enjoyed doing this video for you and i will have plenty more nail vlogs and different things like that coming up but yeah until next time i will see you gems in the next video video. Bye.